I did um, children's theater when I was eight years old, so we would uh, have to audition for the plays, but you were guaranteed a spot in them. Um, that's not how Hollywood works. I did um, a play called Annie and Oliver because the theater company couldn't get the rights to Annie or Oliver. So they did like 49% of Annie and 49% of Oliver as one play. And I played a, <clears throat> a workhouse boy. Uh, well, when I was 14, I did some, yeah, yeah, professional musicals, but I, I was always the understudy in them. So I, I got to perform in all the musicals I've done exactly one time when somebody got really sick. Um, I was an understudy in uh, The Adventures of Tom Sawyer. Yeah, so if one of, if one of the boys uh, fell off the white fence, I got to go paint it for free. I started auditioning f in New York City when I was about 14 years old and I auditioned maybe for like one commercial or two commercials. You know, I started acting to be included in a group because I felt like excluded in school. So, I mean, I couldn't care less what the outcome was. I just like being in a group of people that didn't, uh, you know, kick my shin. But when I was acting in a play, I like I liked knowing my place that I was this role and other people were that role and we could interact with each other in a way that I felt was, uh, you know, very clear to me, If even if I was not in a position that I liked being in, I at least knew that that was my position and I learned to become comfortable with it. Oh yeah, yeah, I read, uh, yeah, Aaron's script for The Social Network, yeah. Yeah, I thought the role was so, uh, you know, it's such a, just kind of such an amusing character. I read four scenes from the movie uh, on a little, you know, um, tape and uh, I mailed it to California the next morning and then I had to take a plane to Seattle to, um, and when I got into Seattle, I called my agent and said, I mailed you it. I mailed a tape to the people of the Facebook movie, but can you call them and try to get it back because I don't think it was good and I think maybe I could do it better. Just give me the week after I get back from Seattle, I will make it again. And she said that she had already received a call from them that I should fly to California immediately to meet with David Fincher, who was directing the movie. Uh, no, I haven't heard from Mark Zuckerberg. I hope he's, you know. Yeah, I can only imagine it must be an uncomfortable experience and he's dealt with everything so wonderfully, much better than I would ever be able to deal with something. When I read something about myself, I'm like uh, tortured for weeks, you know, and I could only imagine it must be so uncomfortable for somebody to uh, have to contend with a movie that's made about them. So I think I'm an abstinence symbol. If I take my shirt off, people will not have babies. Oh, in terms of like Jewish characters, I, I don't think of the first thing I identify with myself is not my religion. Like the first movie I did was called Roger Dodger. I was playing, uh, the director kept telling me, please act more like Woody Harrelson, not like Woody Allen. I think there was a hidden comment there, but I don't know what it was. I told them I wanted to play the part in Zombieland with Paeus because I thought I wasn't doing anything interesting with the character and everybody else in the movie was so interesting. And I said, I, I should play with Paeus. And, um, they all said no. Can I just mention, my, I have a favorite color and I feel like I haven't mentioned it. It's like an, it's an off blue. It's like blue, but a little off. To the left.